Hey guys, Kevin Bupp here, and in this video, I'm going to address the commonly asked question of what comes first, the money or the deal? And really, there's no right or wrong answer. Really, they both come simultaneously. You know, you, you can't do one without the other. So you can't go out and find money for a deal if you don't have a deal to present to investors and vice versa. You can't close on a on a uh, on acquisition without having the capital to do so. And so really, I like to say that you need to be looking for both at the same time. You need to be uh, equally uh, dedicated to finding opportunities that fit your investment criteria as you are finding investors that are uh, going to be aligned with that type of investment opportunity. Okay, And so uh, one doesn't come without the other. Um, and a lot of times in a deal, you don't have that long of a time frame um, you know, to find the money once you find the deal. And so, again, that's why you need to be looking for the capital at the same time you're actually looking for the deal. Because I'll give you an example. Uh, you know, very common nowadays with in, in a hot real estate market, the normal due diligence time frame you might get on a commercial property is 30 days. I've even, even seen it shorter than that. But let's just say it's 30 days. So you have 30 days to do not only your inspections on that property, but to also secure financing, so on the debt side, and also secure the equity side if you're raising capital for the deal. And so uh, a lot a lot needs to happen within that 30 day span because after that 30 days is up, your earnest money is gonna go non-refundable. You wanna make sure that you've got your debt in place and a majority of your equity in place and know that that deal passes uh, your you know the inspection phase and then you know there's no red flags or anything that get thrown. And again, a lot to do in a 30 day time frame. And so you need to be looking for capital, networking, meeting others that are uh, that, that are in the business, that have already been there and done that, you know, get to meet their network, go to meetup groups, go to investment clubs, uh, go to your country club. Uh, you need to be talking to everyone and everybody about what it is you do and how you can help them create generational wealth uh, for their family. So with that, guys, that's all I have for this video. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, please like it. Uh, additionally, if you have an interest in learning more about what it is my team and I do and potentially partnering with us on future deals, go over to investwithsunrise.com. Again, that's investwithsunrise.com and you can learn all about what it is we do at Sunrise Capital Investors. And until next time, guys, you take care.